199 pounds, Kirkins. Guys, you have to think that this battle royal will be one for the ages. Truer words may never have been spoken, Michael. This battle royal has all the elements of an instant classic. And on top of that, this match will undoubtedly have a big impact on where these guys stand in the next WWE.com power rankings. And there's been so much upward... from Manchester, England, weighing in at 245 pounds, A. Dan. A huge opportunity here tonight for one of these superstars to prove their dominance against a whole host of others. Yeah, and whoever ends up winning this battle royal will have certainly earned it. I mean, some of WWE's biggest names are in this match. And remember, when he gets on a roll, he's nearly impossible to stop. You are absolutely right, Cole. So I would expect to see his opposition do everything possible to prevent momentum from swinging too much to his side. from Glens Falls, New York, weighing in at 270 pounds, Hacksaw Jim Duggan. It sounds to me like this crowd is ready to get this battle royal underway. And so are these superstars, Michael. Each and every one of them have a golden opportunity to prove their dominance. And let's not forget about his opposition who also comes into tonight looking to prove a point. Well, I should hope so, Cole. If you don't go into every single match looking to make a statement, then you... from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 316 pounds, Thomas. Guys, this match is sure to not disappoint, especially considering who's involved here tonight. You're absolutely right, Michael. This match will be one we'll be talking about for a long time to come. Some are saying he's in the best shape of his career right now. Would you agree with that, Corey? It's hard not to agree with that statement, Cole. I mean, just look at him. I'll tell you, he's going to be tough to beat, that's for sure.
from Dudley, England, weighing in at 242 pounds, William. Listen to this crowd, guys. They're fired up for this one. As well as they should be, this match has instant classic written all over it. What about you, Byron? He obviously looks good physically, but do you think he's mentally prepared for tonight's match? If he's not, we're going to find out very early on. Guys have a way of smelling intimidation and taking advantage of it. If your head's not at 100%, you're in big trouble. It's that simple. from Warsaw, Poland, weighing in at 230 pounds, Joe, the technician, Jack Oxley. A massive humanity in the ring right now as we get ready for this battle royal. And this is going to be one of those matches where you hope the crew did everything in their power to construct a ring as durably as possible. Otherwise, we might be in for a disaster. From where I sit, he certainly seems more focused than perhaps I've ever seen him. He's got one tall task ahead of him here, that's for sure. from the United States of America, weighing in at 223 pounds, Jaden Jett. As we get started here, let me remind everybody that the only way to get eliminated from this battle royal is to get thrown over the top rope and have both feet touch the arena floor. And not only does it take a tremendous amount of skill to be successful in a battle royal, but there's also a good deal of luck that goes into it as well. Allow me to point out just how focused he appears to be here tonight. I noticed the same thing, Cole. In fact, it looks to me like he'll settle for nothing short of a victory here in this one. This is it, fellas. We're ready to get this thing started. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Brian, I'd say the last time this city had a buzz like this when Ric Flair defended the WWE Championship against Randy Savage at WrestleMania 8. Getting his attention with a vicious strike. Well, moves like that at this stage are not to win any match. It's, they're just used to send a message. Let's take a moment to talk about Duggan. You're the so-called expert, so what can we expect from him tonight? He's got to lay low, for God's sake. This is a battle royal. And when I say that, I don't mean from the physical aspect. I mean, be conservative about who and when you decide to mix it up with him there. It's important for him to keep a low profile early on here so he has the energy he'll need when it's time to make it down the home stretch. And he delivers a spirited elbow. He hits him with a nasty chop. Jet struggling some here. He needs to create some space and find a way to get back on the offensive. He seemed more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. 
Tough situation to be in right here. Yeah, and you have to think this is not going to end well. He is a one-man gang in there. Missed by a large margin on that one. Wow, he's better than that. He's got to be vigilant about not taking any more damage to the neck. Oh boy, he is rolling. Here he goes. And he lands a nice counter. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. Oh, I think this man means business. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. Getting nailed with a strike like that lets you know just what kind of fight you're in. Pays for that one. He's not getting up. You can't like his chances right now. He gets it with a reversal. Here's his chance to win this. Well, he got him. Let's look at this again. He's focusing on the face now. Incoming! Ain't no stopping him now. The final elimination. And this one is over. Here is your winner, the Grim Reaper. What a grueling victory here in this elimination match. To be the last one standing after such a grueling encounter is beyond amazing, Michael. And it's matches like this one that make SmackDown such a success. Thank you so much for joining us.